Hey, Don Copeland here, uh, using our MUTO 661, but more excitingly, we want to show you great new technology we've been working on for the last few months with our, our manufacturers, as well with our software vendor, and just sort of some uh, sweat equity here on a great new process of UV direct to film, DTF. It allows you to, to adhere to difficult items that are hard to print, items that may have contours you can't get to, recessed areas that are difficult to get to, and just get great results. So we're going to print a little bit here in a minute. I want to show you a couple of applications. This is a stainless steel tumbler, as you can see. Beautiful finish on it, and this sucker is on there. It is not coming off. Really, really aggressive attachment. Here's a really difficult one. This is actually, if you look, see the contours in the glass? All right, we actually were able to mold this into that contour of the glass. There is no way you would ever print this direct with any type of printing process, even pad printing, because there's no way you're gonna get that kind of alignment and that kind of clear to the top of it. Let's show you how we printed these. All right, I've, as you see, I've got a vacuum bed on the MUTO here, and I've actually taped off a space. This is actually just a removable clear vinyl, I mean white vinyl. And what I've done is I've actually made it just the right size for my material. What that's gonna do is it's gonna concentrate the vacuum right in the area where the mat's at, where the material's at. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn my vacuum on. See that draws down, that way I can position it where I want it. All right, that's all set up. Now I wanna remove, there's actually a film over top of this. You can see right here, see if Hannah can get in here close enough. There's a clear, right there, there it is. As you can see, it's starting to pull away. And actually what we have is an adhesive we're gonna print onto. There you go. Go ahead and close that up. Send it in. All right, there's our print. As you can see, there's a nice clear coat over top of the print. Pretty attractive. What do we got? We got six, uh, 11. We got 15 decals on here. All right, I'm gonna just load this into our laminator. This is now, I'm gonna marry this first page to the second. This is basically our A material. If you've done any direct to film or any uh, white laser toner printing. All right. All right, and I'm gonna go ahead and hit enter. So we're just gonna go ahead and load this. go trim that off all right we got a couple of items here we're going to apply to this is just a piece of acrylic but i wanted to show you transfer onto a flat substrate as well got a pint glass here and this is a really difficult to do tumbler because it's got this lip right It'd be very hard to, to do this on a regular rotary so we're going to do it onto this stainless steel tumbler as well literally i'm just going to cut this out and we're going to just literally peel this off Pretty simple to get started. Right. I like to peel the backing first from this side. Gives you a little bit better pickup. We're gonna take this, lay our cup down, center it up, straight and center. There you have it. Literally just using thumb pressure to press it on. Then you just want to pull it straight back. Voila. All right, we can do the pint glass now. Just gonna stick this one to a piece of acrylic. All right, there we have it. See, we've done three different types of materials. This is glass which is anybody knows you try to do this is very difficult to do. You can see you've got good adhesion on this. 
This is only gonna get better after a day or so. So you, you will get a little bit, there is a little bit of a clear over the top of it, so it kind of gives you a lip and gives you a nice finish. Another difficult to do material, stainless steel, plus a difficult item to print because of the lip. And lastly, just to show it on a different substrate, this is actually just an acrylic, as you can see, straight onto the acrylic, just beautiful finish. Nice adhesion there. Lots of other items we've done, items with recesses and stuff, but we'll get to that in the next couple weeks. We'll show you some more videos. Just wanted to give you guys a look at the newest and the greatest thing coming out, DTF for UV.